welcome back to our channel. I'm Serena. I'm Brian. And we are the Falco family. You guys liked that, didn't you? We are a homeschooling family of five. Loving, living, and... Learning. Together, where homeschool is... Life. <laughs> Basically, you guys, we are talking about our family vision. You guys already know I'm all about vision and um, just putting those things before you that you have in your heart. Um, just being able to visually see them, to write them down constantly, to get them out so that they become reality in your life. So a few years ago, we made the decision to, to homeschool our kids. I think I'm already on the record of saying that I wasn't I wasn't a fan of it in the beginning, but have become an avid supporter. You guys, we took the risk and decided to sell everything and travel the world. No. <laughs> but that's kind of not our vision. Um, we like the idea of having a home, a home for people to come, um, a home for to share with others and entertain and. Um, just like have that home base. However, I am obsessed with following families after adventure and I was talking to Brian about, you know, just our vision for our family and I'm like, we need like that pull. I do love the idea of being able to say that we took the risk and we sold everything to travel the world. However, that's not us. <laughs> we would like to incorporate more travel for sure and we would like to incorporate our gifts and we would love to be able to spend more time together um, as a family. And so this basically, this channel is our journey. Basically, our journey of living this life of faith and love. I am looking for God to do a new thing in our lives. I am not trying to compare myself to others. However, I definitely am an advocate for watching the great things that other people are doing and extracting some of the lessons um, to incorporate it into our own lives. So I was sitting back one day watching um, some traveling families and I just was dreaming about, you know, who we are and what we do. As Brian said already, um, I do photography. I am obsessed. It is a gift that gives me so much um, and allows me to give back to others. God gave me the idea of a journey journalist. Uh, a journalist of our journey um, and other so kind of like a travel journalist but not so um, I started with the rebrand of our little spaces on the internet and we rebranded our website and um, our social media accounts and things like that to include a little bit more of that vision. Basically, that means that we are sharing our journey and we would love to be able to go all around and document and share the journey of others, you know, because the joy really is in the journey. It's really not about the destination. It's about who you become along the way. To process. Yeah. Process. We have our photography and videography business, which we want to get better and better at storytelling through photos and through video and with words. Um, and then we also have the Falco. So the Falco is a place where we make t-shirts and we want to add other things to the mix. Basically, the Falco is a place where you can go and find things for the journey. Get it? Things for the journey? <laughs> So, like I said, we are journey journalists and we make things for the journey, right? Mm -hmm. That's perfect, you guys, right? <laughs> so, I wanted to include Brian in on these videos and on this channel a lot more. Of course, everything we do here is about homeschool because we believe that... Oh, this is my part? Yes! We believe that homeschool is... Oh, yeah, life. Everything around here is homeschool for us, and it's about more than just curriculum. It's about the things that we all learn together along the way. Taking advantage of those learning opportunities, making everything an opportunity to teach the kids. Yeah. And us, because we're all learning um, together. We just wanted to do more videos about life and the things that we are learning in life. Videos about motherhood, more videos about... Um, keeping our home and family time, and what else, Brian? What about Marriage. Fatherhood? Oh, yeah, fatherhood. 
Which, what kind of videos you playing? I don't know yet. Okay. Figure that out along the journey. Oh, okay. <laughs> About motherhood and fatherhood. Like I said, we believe that everything is a lesson and this journey is all about learning along the way. So some of the things that we are really standing on as far as who we are include first starting with writing the vision and making it very plain. I think it's important for you to have vision as a family. Um, I think it's important for you to communicate with one another because to be honest, a lot of this was my idea. I think they probably picked that up. <laughs> <laughs> but over the years, I've communicated it, over communicated it to him. And I mention that because I get a lot of um, communication from other moms who I can clearly see have a major vision for their family and are oftentimes waiting for their spouse to get on board. A long time ago, I learned that um, I can't be upset that he doesn't have my vision, especially if I didn't communicate it. So I feel like, you know, sometimes we make the mistake of thinking that it, if we talk to them once about what we would like to see for our families that they automatically will get it and that's not the case i think we're each other's helpers and um, sometimes he has ideas sometimes hi i have ideas for our family and it's our jobs to be able to communicate that to one another and over communicate it so that to paint a picture that's similar to the vision that you have in your heart as far as who we are along this journey since i don't know there's no blueprint for what I envision or the vision that God has given me I know that it's different you know we're looking for him to do something new in our lives four main things that I was given in my heart as far as how to look for the Lord to do something new in our lives first one being to write the vision because I need to be clear on the vision that he's given me in my heart so I use our big old vision board in our garage to make sure that I have some visuals to kind of like connect the dots so that when I get distracted and start to look at what others are doing I can go back to what the vision is that he's given me for our lives the next thing is just to make sure that I'm always looking to God at the start you know the word says to seek first the kingdom and then all these other things will be added to you so important in this journey because I don't know where this is gonna lead us but we're just going for it um, and then the next thing would be to guard our heart above all else the kids and I are working on this verse in school right now and it's perfect because it's really just kind of seeping down into our hearts to make sure that we have our guard up and that we're careful what we let in to make sure that comparison is not stealing the new thing that God is doing in our lives and then the last thing is just to trust him after we take those steps we just need to trust that that he will give us direction and show us where to go. And so we have to trust in him with all of our heart. Don't lean on our own understanding of things and we know that he will direct us to show us where to go because we don't know where we're going. And if we try to figure it out on our own, it's gonna, it's just gonna fail. <laughs> so. So those are the four um, so those are the four scriptures that I had in my heart about this journey because like I said I don't know what I'm doing or where I'm going with it but um, I'm excited uh, for the adventure that's basically what this is an adventure so Serena has been a photographer for 10 years now so she's always had that we've kind of picked it up and put it back down you know as, as we've had kids and as things have gotten busy she used to do wedding photography in the beginning yeah we've been portrait photography maternity photography so we still do photography that has kind of moved on into also videography I think that's where I've kind of moving into the um, to her businesses that's kind of where I really like doing is the, the being involved with the video portion one of our favorite things to do together is watch movies and we are obsessed with the story it's it's just a wonderful way to be able to communicate is to storytell. We just kind of have this vision of being able to storytell with our photos and with video and with words. We're kind of looking to be storytellers, you know, we're kind of storytellers of the journey. Um, and I've been working on the website. So as we've been doing the, the vlogs for the past, I guess, three, almost four years now, I kind of developed really a, a, a love for that whole process, you know, the storytelling process. So with the most of you know by now, we had Falco, which we started about two years ago. It's been 
um, very slow progress, but I guess some <laughs> progress is best than no progress. Along the way, you just need encouragement. We need to learn how to encourage one another, but also to encourage ourselves. So I wear my tees all the time. I'm trying to get this one to wear his tee all the time. Actually, he does. He does. Yeah, those are our two businesses. So this video was basically meant to share a little bit of our vision with you, um, because I think it's really super important for us to have vision as a family. Um, together we are so much stronger and we can make so much more of a difference when we work together as a family and just really walk in what was meant for us. So that's what we're doing and we hope to encourage you to do the same and kind of walk this journey out as families together. So yeah, um, I hope you guys are excited for more videos. Living, loving, and learning together where homeschool is. Life. Life. <laughs> and we will see you in our next videos. Bye. And we're done today. That's we're a wrap. Done. When do I get paid for this? When do you get paid? Yeah. Guy. Okay. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm dead serious. You get paid every day. Okay. Thumbnail. <laughs> 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 Say bye.